Hey, what's up? I'm Nicole Aaron, and this is University TV, where we put you in university. Today, we're at North Dakota State University, home of the bison. NDSU is located in Fargo, North Dakota, which got the nickname the Gateway to the West in the late 1800s as the railroad moved towards the West Coast. Sitting on the banks of the Red River of the North, Fargo features a population of just under 100,000 residents, with about 175,000 in the entire metropolitan area. North Dakota State University sits on a 258-acre campus and has more than 90 major buildings. The school features beautiful landscaping and a nice mixture of classic college and modern exteriors. Enrollment at North Dakota State is approximately 12,000 students, with just over 10,000 undergraduates. The student body is also diverse, with over 800 international students and more than 700 transfer students. The nice thing about what I think of as sort of a middle-sized school, which NDSU is, is we pull undergraduates into the lab. So very early on, if you're a chemistry major, for example, you're pulled into the lab research of professors who are doing really internationally recognized work. Um, not everyone gets involved in that, but when we can, we like pulling folks in as, as soon as their first year here. In addition to required core high school courses, students should have a 2.5 grade point average or better, along with a 21 or higher on the ACT or a 970 or better on the SAT. Uh, our core courses uh, are important as well, college prep courses, courses that students will take uh, in high school, as well as around a 2.5 GPA. What we do is we take a look at the core GPA, so we're very concerned about those college courses, those college prep courses that they have to take. Tuition including room and board runs approximately $12,000 per year for in-state students and approximately $20,000 per year for out-of-state students. I think one of the most exciting things that we're doing in engineering is we're, we're putting together teams of, of engineering students with business students and having them work on, with faculty on some kind of engineering innovation. The idea being that the students will develop the intellectual property, they will also develop the business, marketing, and finance plan, and then actually spin off a company. And so last summer we had our first success. Um, we had a team of students that developed a medical device that tests other medical devices, and they've spun off a company, and we've got three or four more ready to go this year. NDSU offers more than 100 undergraduate majors, 56 master's programs, and 41 doctoral programs. Some of the more popular majors include engineering, business, education, and natural sciences. Here we're in the IV room, and what happens here? Here students learn how to properly um, take a look at a medication or a prescription perhaps that a patient would be receiving in a hospital and they use our laminar airflow hoods. We've got two different types in here so we're very fortunate um, to learn how to prepare these in an aseptic manner. For example, here we've got an antibiotic that would typically be prepared for a patient in a hospital. Mm -hmm. Since 80% of undergraduate classes at NDSU have 40 students or less, and major courses average about 25 students per classroom, you're not likely to get lost in the crowd. NDSU supports a wide range of innovative technology research projects that include visual neuroscience, nanotechnology, bioengineering, and more. NDSU employs over 450 full-time faculty members, and an impressive 95% hold a PhD or the highest degree attainable in their field. The university also has a student-to-teacher ratio of 90 to one. Touchdown in the Fargo Dome. Athletics play a huge part on campus life. With 14 men's and women's bison teams, NDSU has the first Division I athletic program in the state. NDSU's Wellman Wellness Center is just one place for students to get fit. They have everything from racquetball courts to climbing walls. 12 residence halls plus additional housing options give students a great opportunity to live on campus and make new friends while being close to class. As a side note, all first year students are required to live on campus. Um, and with dorm life, you just meet so many people and the nice thing about NDSU is when you're walking across campus, um, you'll always run into a familiar face, which a lot of people really, really enjoy and appreciate. With over 200 organizations and 15 sororities and fraternities on campus, there's lots of opportunities for students to get involved. The Division of Fine Arts in particular provides student involvement and entertainment. Architecture landscape students design this babbling brook. A couple times a year, this brook bubbles over after some mischievous students slip in some soap. 
NDSU is gaining a national reputation for its research activities. When research funding exceeded 100 million in 2004, NDSU jumped into the top 20% of the nation's research universities. Are you missing your best friend? Well, at NDSU, there are baby beagles here waiting for your love. Today I'm taking a stroll with Pilot and Dipstick, and they are part of NDSU's four-year veterinary tech program. If you're looking for a medium-sized Midwestern college that offers technological research programs and comfortable class sizes, you probably want to make North Dakota State University next on your list of schools to visit. Thanks for joining us here in Fargo on our tour of North Dakota State University. I'm Nicole Aaron. Goodbye for now.